What's going on guys, it's me Benchable21 and welcome to another episode of um, something brand new and I thought to myself, you know what, I might as well do an old classic game and games I mean because there is a second one to this but there's no third one. Really sad about that, I don't explain more about it. Um, I thought to myself, you know what, an actual good thing to post on the channel, I'm going to do this a couple of times a year for something and I want to play back an old classic game and one of my favourite games... <coughs> I remember playing on the PC I was introduced to was um, the orange box and I think I could show it right here. This is backwards compatible on the Xbox One X. Um, I think it's £15 or something, I can't remember. But I had it already installed so that was amazing. And what it includes is five games inside. Uh, Half-Life Trilogy of episode of second one. Uh, a game called Portal, which we're going to be looking at today's episode, and then um, a game called Team Fortress 2, but I can't guarantee you Team Fortress 2 cannot do it, because Valve created this amazing game called Half-Life and Portal. But the problem is, though, um, the, the owner known as Game Newell, he can't count to three, and there's no third one. It's just a long, complicated story, but I thought to myself, Portal's an absolutely fantastic game to um, play and revisit, so I thought to myself, you know what, we're going to do that, and we're going to hop into a brand new game. So, what Portal is, though, is that um, you make portals and you go through them really amazing and i kind of slightly prefer portal than half-life i don't know really but also love to know guys in the comments below would you like to see me play half-life 2 i'm mainly insane 2 because um i don't have the right equipment for a pc so yeah so i'm a bit sorry about that but yeah this looks all fine and amazing also you have noticed i got new gaming headphones these are absolutely ridiculously amazing and the total beach and there's something called um total beach x700 sorry called stealth 700 and they're bluetooth so the wireless all i have to do really though is um turn it on it does need to charge up so i can charge it there turn it on link it to your um gaming account because i'm signed as um Badge board 21 do that and then any game sound comes through and that's it and that's brilliant so yeah I better let you guys know it's amazing heads for it by the way i can't exactly remember the price and i don't want to be too much of a show off but yeah this is portal an absolutely amazing game and yeah this is literally the beginning of um, portal i believe someone talks within the last 40 seconds i can't remember Hello, yeah. and again, welcome to the Aperture Science Computer Aided Enrichment Center. We hope your brief detention in the relaxation vault has been a pleasant one. Your specimen has been processed, and we are now ready to begin the test proper. Before we start, however, keep in mind that although fun and learning are the primary goals of all enrichment center activities, serious injuries may occur. For your own safety and the safety of others, Please refrain from the portal will open in three, two, one. <laughs> and there you go, you can see clearly their um portals and stuff as well, so that's amazing. And also if you guys are thinking we are playing as a female in this um game, the fun fact is that um she doesn't talk. She says not a single word, which is quite upsetting. And you probably think, what is the history of this? Well, you have to find out and play, and I'm going to be talking through it and what we've got to do. So pretty much, Portal is like, there's something called Aperture Science, which we are at the moment. And what we've got to do is just test. We're just testing, testing. And like, I don't know where the scientist Excellent. people are, but... Please proceed into the chamber lock after completing each test. First, however, note the incandescent part Wait, of the field across the exit. This aperture science material prevents a patient grid will vaporize any unauthorized equipment that passes through it. Oh, gosh. For instance, the aperture science weighted storage cube. Sorry, there was an achievement I remembered in the past, but I don't know if I've got it. You have to destroy those cameras throughout the game. But yeah, pretty much Aperture Science. Um, they're these scientists, and he explains more in the second game, which we will do once I get a chance to. Um, pretty much Aperture Science is this massive science thing. I don't, I can't exactly remember the year or not, because I don't think it actually says so in this game. Maybe in the second one, I can't remember. But yeah, and um, there's 19 test chambers we've got to um, complete and just do a lot of testing with it and just place, just place what we've got to do. So you're probably thinking, when do we actually get to control the portal? But we don't control it just yet, though. So I bet you let you know. So now we've got the cube. We just gotta place it on here perfectly. Perfect. And then, Please yeah, the we can go. As the effects of prolonged exposure to the button are not part of this test. 
But yeah, this game is a lot. You might be thinking it's a bit old, isn't it? It is. But on PC, they've, the PC just keeps graphics up to date because I don't know when we're going to get a gaming computer. Maybe in about three years' time. I don't know exactly. I really haven't thought about it. But like, um, it's quite interesting just to say how well like this game has been. Like Valhalla creates such amazing games, and also there is some bit of loading here and now and there. So yeah, it's a bit of a problem. I am only going to keep this around 20 minutes long, hopefully for you guys as well. But if we are not completed the um, test chamber, we'll need to continue on. So now we get to start using the portal gun for the first time. There we go. And all we gotta do is just collect it and start using it, which is an amazing tool so we can create portals. You are now in possession of the Aperture Science handheld portal device. With it, you can create your own portals. Wait, I think those are, These yeah, the dimensional gates have proven to be completely safe. The device, however, has not. Do not touch the operational end of the device. Do not look directly at the operational end of the device. Do not submerge the device in liquid, even partially. Most importantly, under no circumstances should move. <laughs> It's so cr it's so weird as well when you play it because look like look look at this like look you're just teleporting to where you want to go and I think we can slightly see what our character looks if I know it really helps if we're in the corner or not unless hold on yeah yeah you can slightly see who we are at the moment so that's pretty amazing to say but yeah it's a bit I'm confused by the way the stuff we can only this may sound crazy the portal guns technology only works on moon rock and that's what you see and if white um objects uh, wallpaper or uh, concrete, no, not concrete, moon's material's not concrete, it's part of a moon, literally though, after science gathers um, stuff from the moon, bring it back, testing for it, it's how you're able to make these portal holes, but the problem is though, we've only got the Please standard the one, where, um, where, well, when we've only got to the um, regular the one, so yeah, well, we've got the basic one that only does one, because, We've only got this one because of the fact that, um, yeah. I don't care because I think there's an achievement I haven't even done yet. So look, boom, like that. Look, <laughs> it's just amazement. Like, like, look, look, it's just an amazing game. By the way, blue's my favorite color, but orange isn't, no, but, oh well. But pretty much though, um, yeah, all we're just doing is just testing and testing. And there is a wall for us at the end, so that's going to be amazing. But I will say to you guys is that, yeah, it does... The beginning's really weird and mysterious. You're like to yourself, oh gosh, where have we been? Where where are we and stuff? you just got to keep playing and find out what's going on. Yeah, it's just incredible. Welcome well, the next Chamber one. You're doing quite well. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I've got the achievement destroying these cameras. I really can't remember. To your success. Do not destroy testing apparatus. Ow. I thought the cube would land on it. Oh well. Um, all we gotta do is just place the cube on there. Perfectly, like that. Such an easy one. Oh. Just to say though, those things they come by, it just cancels out the scan, so we can't place the same portals again and again and again. So yeah, just to cheat or anything like that. It's just a system that just clears it all up and just sharp and still around but I will admit though like you probably think it's a bit lonely and confusing what's going on trust me it gets a lot better and Valve really do amazing jobs with their games but they, there is no portal 3 unfortunate which is really upsetting yeah I think there's an achievement I need to do to get that I really can't remember it's been a while oh yeah you can't shoot through the portal like you have to um physically um go for it it looks so weird though but when i get the right one when i get um the ability to deploy to i'll explain more what i mean yeah hold on I shoot there where does it go oh yeah I remembered and then we pick this up and we complete it that easy that's literally that easy of how we've got to oh Excuse me, I forgot there's crouch buttons in there, so yeah. As part of a required test protocol, our previous statement suggesting. Also, there's no full damage thanks to our boots as well. I better say that as well. Good job. As part of <laughs> oh, why a I keep crouching? Test protocol, we will stop enhancing the truth in three, two. Oh, 
well. But yeah, um, <clears throat> I really can't say who the voice um, person will only human at the moment because it. <clears throat> I just don't want to say really. I just don't want to spoil anything. It's a bit like um. Oh gosh, I'm not exactly sure what to say though. But yeah, it does seem a bit boring at the moment with um, just having this. And it, I will admit, these tests are very easy to do, but there's also a hard mode for it as well. So yeah, we'll say that. Oh, this is an easy one. Right. Too easy. Too easy. It's a bit odd though, there's only black black balls plus it's just preventing us anyway, so that's another example of why. But yeah, those literally you have to complete the you have to complete the game first of all to unlock the hard mode. And the hard mode is though is that all the test levels are very difficult and the movement space is very difficult as well, the bear one you, but I'm not gonna to explain to you much why about it. Also, Jay, that reminds me, um another thing I love about these headphones is that you're probably thinking, how do you mute people and you've got no bottom thing or whatever? A bit quick cut ah, sorry, I don't want to over talk or whatever. However, alarms and flashing hazard lights have been found to agitate good. Now use the aperture science on stationary scaffold to reach the chamber lock. I was going to say, by the way, the way I talk is that I have to bring this all the way down, and you may have heard a noise, I'm not sure if it will pick it up, but once you do that, you're able to talk to people, and that's how it works, that's pretty impressive, but then um, if you don't want to talk, do that, it mutes it, and then that's just protected, so this is a really incredible headset, and I think I've got two years insurance on it, I don't know if it continues on from my original headphones, I can't remember, but... Yeah, that's still impressive. So I have these really small earpieces, but yeah, I just love the fact as well with these headphones. There's no wire. There's literally no wire. I'm just gonna be looking amazing. It's just so nice as well. But also big as well, perfect for the ears. It keeps the hair um, nicely done. But yeah, again, I just don't want to be a show off with these headphones. But they're just incredible. But mainly back to where we are at the moment with Portal. Um, we're still testing. So yeah, that's interesting. One of eight, and this is why it gets this is why it gets harder. This is when it gets a lot harder. Good luck. And I believe I. Hold on. Why did I do that? No, that's not gonna work. Oh! Now I remember how to do it. Oh my gosh, I'm an absolute idiot. Now I remember how we've got to complete it. I've just got to do it like that, and then... Hold on. Oh, you're joking. It's what? It's it's a bit further up. Oh, for goodness sake. Oh, there's, there's a zoom button, because there's, because there's a zoom button for the second game, but I can't remember if there's a zoom button for this one. There we go, that's perfect. Now, all I've got to do is just get out safely. So, I go here, I'm safe, and then I'm just going to place it there. It looks so weird and trippy. Like, it's like you got a wall open upon. Because when I first played this game, I was just like, what the hell's up with these um, portals? It's just so crazy taking all the knowledge in at the moment. And it's just ridiculously crazy. But yeah, I don't know how long this is going to be. I'm really I'm sorry if this is going to be short or not. Cause it's been a very long time since I played Portal. So yeah, a bit sorry about the Portal 1 and Portal 2. We will do Portal 2 series. But... Yeah, that's impressive. Also, I was supposed to explain what I was going to be uploading for my channel. I was supposed to do it at the beginning of this video. I'm going to say that in a minute. Okay, now that's what I've got. I better quickly talk about um, what's going to happen. I'm going to remind myself to this at the beginning of the episode, just to remind you guys. Um, I'm going to try and do two Portal episodes and include Portal 2. If I do Portal 1 and Portal 2, then hopefully that might be a bit split. And then I'm planning on doing two more. Uh, there might be a pattern like two of this, two of Fortnite, and two of whatever. This next test is impossible. Make no attempt to solve it. It's too easy. Oh! I forgot. Oh, gosh, damn it. I've literally forgot that actually can happen. But yeah, it's just so weird though, of how it works. There we go. Fantastic. You also place it like that. <clears throat> no, 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 wait, where the cameras? Oh gosh, I've literally forgot, to, I just remembered that I was supposed to destroy these cameras and see where they are. No. How can, um, oh, I don't want to say, a I don't want to say who is talking, but Ah, oh, for goodness sake, I was supposed to check that there was some cameras there, but I'm going to explain again while I'm doing my uploads. Um, I'm going to try and do two of this, 
And then in the Clash of Clans update, although when this video comes out, you'll see that after these two episodes. Otherwise, it's going to be some Fortnite because the Clash of Clans update might be happening tomorrow, which is on Monday. So I hope about that. But what I'm going to try and do, actually, because if I do do that, I'm not sure if I want to do an episode of me getting the gold or I get the gold and just wait. I don't know. It's probably going to be seven days upgrading or something. I don't know exactly, but oh, well. Oh, I know this one. This is easy. There we go. That was just... Pardon me. Just too easy. One, number ten now. Great, we're over halfway. I know how to do this. I just remembered... You appear to understand how a portal affects forward momentum, or to be more precise, how it does not. Just crazy easy. Like, they've literally put so much this black stuff to prevent you from um, cheating or doing some other things. It's just a way of saying, um, screw you, or whatever. And this is what you got to do for the next one. you got to go down here and, yeah, like that. Momentum. Boom. But wait. Of mass and velocity is conserved between portals. Also, you can't place them while you move. That's a bit annoying, but oh well. Out. Oh well, indeed. But yeah, let's go again and boom, yeah. Like that, we're done. So that's amazing. And we're coming on to 16 minutes. The time is my recording, but I will come. To, I might try and make this 21 minutes long. I'm not 100 percent too sure because I don't want to bore you guys up. But yeah, um, with the Clash Clans update, I'm not sure we're going to do it uploading because I will try and do Fortnite as well, and then Portal because I don't want to keep doing too much Fortnite because it will irritate you guys so much. Also, my chair's not back to normal yet. I don't know why. What what am I doing wrong with replacing or getting stuff fixed? But yeah. I don't know, really. Don't ask me. The enrichment center promises to always provide a safe oh, now we get to use both the portal holes. Brilliant. The, the enrichment center promises to always provide useful advice. You better also For check what it says as well. Will kill you. Try to avoid it. Oh, 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 what do I do? Oh, this is fine now. Oh, for goodness sake, what was I supposed to do? Ah, oh, now I remember what I need to do. No, what? I'm an absolute ninja poop, I know what to do. Hold on, we've got a blast of portal in there. And we just gotta wait for the orange one to come and deploy to where we are. But once we grab that portal gun, we'll be able to do a blue and an orange portal hole, and that's going to really help us out. But yeah, we just got to wait for it to come by, come by, come by. But we've got to make sure we don't get killed. That's a problem, though. I just don't want to happen. So, yeah, there we go. We're fine. Okay, there we go. I think that's the right way we need to shoot. Come on. Shoot through. Yes, there we go. It's going to hit perfectly. Nicely done. Here's the big problem. I need to remember to wait for it because I want the um, portal to be on the side of where the um, footpath's going to be. So I'm going to need to wait here until it sees it. So wait for it and then... Yeah, there we go. Perfect. And then we'll be able to pick up the um, ability to have both portal abilities. So that's going to be amazing. So I'm just going to wait for it. I'll also look around actually in case there's CCTV cameras I need to look out for. But I don't think so. Oh well. But now we have the ability to place orange and blue. Two linked portals at once. This there we go. Of an test we are to an That's the exit. I believe oh, I've got to do that, yeah. So now since um I've placed an orange one in there, there's also a bit of a circle in the middle. I don't know why is that. I really don't remember seeing that before. <clears throat> well, unless it just tells me the last one. But yeah, well, the good news is though is that I have placed a portal through the door when it was open. So yeah, that's good enough. And we should be able to just go through here um, safely. So let me just go down. Perfect. Like that. And yeah, this is just amazing how we do it. So that is absolutely incredible. I might do one more test chamber. I'm, I'm, I'm really I'm not too sure now because I just got the weapon. But we might do one quickly if I can. It just depends on what we're doing. But 
<clears throat> Pardon me, but yeah, I'm not too sure actually. I'm also thinking of doing the hard mode as well for these um, portals. Uh, yeah, that's going to be called a test chamber number 12. We'll do this one and then we'll take a break and then they'll be in the next episode. Yeah, fling the space, that's what we're going to do. Just like that. And now I need to get a bit higher. Get ready, get ready, get ready. Jump down, reset a new one. Hey, we've made it perfectly. Now all we got to do is just work out where that companion cube is. Oh, okay, so the um, place has been really nice. Aperture Science has been really nice, but yeah, let's get that perfect. And then there's a third jump. Oh, no way, hold on. Uh, and there we go, we get the companion cube, which is going to help us a lot. So I'm going to jump. Also, oh, there's literally no fall damage because what I've hopefully said is that we've got some certain, we've got these um, amazing boots that actually help us out. So that's incredible. We... Boom. Thank you very much, uh, computer. We're going to call you computer, but you may have noticed right now is that the voice uh, for the computer is female. So that might give you a little hint to um, who it is. But yeah, that's going to be amazing. So yeah, um, I'll get up to here and then I'm going to save it. And then just in case though something goes wrong, in case my stuff crash shot, I'm just going to pause, save it here. Uh, new save. Yes, please. I'll take that. Uh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go, and we only played for about 18 minutes here. Oh well. But guys, that's going to be ending off part one of Portal. In the next episode, we're going to be taking a look at Portal part two. And then um, there might be two more Fortnite videos than Portal. And I have no idea, because I'm going to do two Rainbows videos and two Clash Clans videos. But the Clash Clans, I'm not sure if I want to do one prepared and then one uh, exploring Build a Hall 8. I'm not too sure. And the Rainbows videos, uh, Line and Doquette, Line and um, Finker and some matches with them or something like that. I'm not 100% too sure of just seeing what it is going to happen. But yeah, guys, that's going to be ending off today's episode there. I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. A bit of a bonus video of a classic game known as Portal. If you guys enjoyed today's video, don't forget to leave a like, comment, and share with your friends. Also, subscribe to the channel to see some latest Portal videos on Fortnite and everything else. But yeah, guys, I'll see you in the next episode. Have an awesome day, everyone. Take care and goodbye.